This week on the World Poker Tour, WPT Tampa came to its brilliant end with Brian Altman earning his way into the exclusive group of WPT champions who have won the prestigious title three times. Live events see the return of our WPT team seeking out the best off the felt activities to get yourselves stuck into. The GOAT Phil Ivey is back taking down the Poker King Media Heads Up Championship and the WPT Venetian commences this week over in Las Vegas. That's this week on the WPT. The debut season 19 WPT Seminole Hard Rock Tampa main event boiled down from 1,165 entries to just six final players for the nail-biting finale. Will Berry, John Haas, Jonathan Jaffa, Zachary Smiley, Gabriel Abisada, and our champion, Brian Altman, is his third WPT title here. This inaugural event produced a result that has happened twice before already at Seminole Hard Rock Properties. With two titles under his belt, both occurring at the Lucky Hearts Poker Open at the Seminole Hard Rock in Hollywood. Brian Altman topped the field here in Tampa, winning an astounding $613,225. Altman will have his name etched onto the Mike Sexton WPT Champions Cup for the third time. And here is what he had to say about his victory. This is a really special World Poker Tour title for me. I'm joining the elusive club of three-time champions, which only a handful of people have done. So to be among that company is, uh, makes me feel really proud and, and special. My experience playing WPT Tampa for the first time was fantastic. The venue is beautiful, the, the staff is great, the tournaments are well run. I have had a blast down here. To win back-to-back -back World Poker Tour Player of the Year titles would be incredible. It's never been done before. To kind of cement myself as one of the top guys on tour would mean a lot. To earn my fourth title and, and, and chase Darren down would be pretty awesome. Uh, he's a, a buddy of mine, and uh, I appreciate him taking this one off and giving me a, <laughs> giving me a better shot to win, so uh, kudos. Altman is also currently the reigning Hublo WPT Player of the Year and is off to an incredible start to not only accomplish that honor twice, but also in direct succession. Altman joins just five other players as three-time WPT champion. Carlos Mortensen, Gus Hansen, Chino Reem, Eric Afriat, and Anthony Zeno, and is superseded only by Darren Elias's four WPT titles. My name is Brian Altman. I'm a three-time WPT champion, and I'm coming for you, Darren. <laughs> They say that all work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. And with return of live events means the return of off the felt activities. The WPT team got a chance to explore the fun adventures that Tampa has to offer. Got it. Oh, All right, here we go. God, I keep thinking I'm gonna, my face is gonna look cool and then no, because <laughs> You're going so fast, you forget. <laughs> so you look like this. <laughs> hey, we had a great time, another great day in Tampa. Uh, this event is incredible and um, another great memory in the books. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. The GOAT is back. A huge congratulations to Phil Ivey for winning the WPT Heads Up Championship on Poker King Media. Ivy was up against tough competition, triumphing over the likes of legends Tom Dwan, Nick Petrangelo, Patrick Antonius, Stephen Chidwick, and even DJ Steve Aoki. If you didn't manage to catch the live streams of these unmissable showdowns, don't worry as you'll be able to catch up and watch them on demand on the WPT YouTube channel. Next up on the WPT live event schedule will be the WPT Venetian in Las Vegas from July 2nd through to the 7th. This is a $5,000 buy-in, $3 million guaranteed main event offering three starting flights on July 2nd, 3rd and 4th. Another new WPT champion will be crowned on July 7th, so follow along with all of the WPT social media and blog news to make sure you don't miss out on all of the updates. Also on the Venetian schedule is the WPT Deep Stacks Venetian, kicking off July 9th with a $2,400 buy-in 
and a humongous two million dollars guaranteed that's all from me today but i will be back next sunday to keep you up to speed with the week's action on the wpt 